HCBS um, Home and Community Based Services. The purpose through Home and Community Based Services, HCBS, waiver programs, consumers with disabilities who require health care and supportive services in order to maintain in their home is in the community based setting. The program is an array of home and community based services that assist Medicaid beneficiaries in, to live in the community and avoid institutionalization. The objective is services must be designed effectively implemented in accordance with each participant's unique needs, expressed preferences, and decisions concerning his or her life in the community. The expected outcomes, HCBS services are intended to assist in daily living skills to help achieve the greatest independence in personal care, community safety, communications, and self-advocacy. Uh, intended population is with individuals um, with disabilities and elderly citizens needing services for support, which permit uh, persons to remain in their home, and they must qualify for Medicaid and also meet the requirements for each waiver. Consumers may receive HCBS services, or it could be brain injury waiver, um, and uh, this is determined by the Iowa Foundation of Medical Care, the um, IFMC, to, ver to verify a brain injury diagnosis. So, uh, need for services would show that they're considered necessary and appropriate to meet the client's need. Um, all members will have a comprehensive service plan developed by the case manager slash DHS service worker in cooperation with the member. The case manager slash DHS service worker provider will implement the services, must sign and date the comprehensive plan, and the member must receive case management services. A comprehensive service plan must be completed prior to the implementation of uh, services. The plan are for members age 20 and under and developed and reviewed um, in consideration uh, with individualized um, education plan, early periodical screening, the diagnosis and uh, treatment uh, plans. So uh, the treatment modality, um, there are several. There, we do have a brain injury, intellectual disability, and physical disability waiver. We are not doing a lot with those uh, right now. As those become services, I will add in policies and procedures for those specific ones. Um, the home and community-based services, all consumers receiving HCBS services will have a health and safety plan in place. This includes an individualized health and safety plan developed by consumers receiving HCBS services. Each plan will identify the following components, an individualized health and safety plan. Uh, needs of the consumer, natural and professional supports available to meet the consumer's health and safety needs, specific staff interventions required to address the consumer's health and safety needs, and an annual, at minimum, evaluation of safety, health, um, effectiveness of the consumer's changing needs. The um, CMH waiver consumer will have a crisis plan developed that will include following components, a current and accurate information regarding the consumer, identification of potential personal, psychiatric, environmental, and medical emergencies for the consumer, identification of the problematic situation um, for the consumer, identification of strategies uh, and natural supports, all that will uh, enable the consumer to self-manage, alleviate, and end crisis. Uh, development of the plan in collaboration with consumer. Pertinent information is shared with the targeted case manager uh, within 24 hours. The targeted case manager is updated with circumstances, issues impacting the consumer's mental health crisis in 24 hours. Um, staff will have a copy of the most current crisis intervention plan during the service delivery of the consumer at all times.